Hey guys, Mike here, um, and with my Traxxas XO1s. Another quick update. I was just gonna say Summit because I, I was just talking about the Summit here. But uh, just a quick little update here. Uh, a few things that I have acquired since the last time <clears throat> I've touched base in regards to these beasts. Um, so, you know, I've decided to get a fan, a cooling fan for my motor. Uh, not that the temperatures were overly hot or anything like that. I just thought it looked really, really cool. Um, you know, also a good thing to have is, you know, an additional, an additional force to keep the temperatures down, I guess, if you will. And, um. And it just looks really, really nice. Um, you know, the installation wasn't too bad. Um, so here, here we go. So this is the part number from Traxxas. Sorry, from Intigy. Jesus, not from Traxxas, Intigy. Um, I got two of them. Um, one fan for uh, my blue X01. This is my drifter, my everyday kind of parking lot basher vehicle and one. I got um, for this X01 uh, that's never hit the tarmac, but I um, I upgrade this one, um, you know, while I upgrade this one. So I do them uh, simultaneous, simultaneously. Um, so yeah, let me show you. Here, oops, excuse me. Um, here's the fan, here is Z fan, and um, you know, it's 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 very easy install on these cars. Uh, it cost me 25 Canadian, 25 Canadian. Can you imagine? Uh, for two little fans, I mean, I could probably order them for you know a couple bucks off of eBay. But it's into G, it's into G. <laughs> I just like into G a lot and it looks pretty cool. Uh, the install uh, for this wasn't difficult at all. Um, excuse me. And um, here, let me show you that the install was not too bad at all. Uh, so we got a couple of wires so <clears throat> we got a black and a red coming out of this one and a black and a red coming out of this one and um, you know I just took some electrical tape uh, bound it together uh, wired it across here and uh, stopped it here that's as far as it'll go now these two no, you know, I got, I got, I got them in pairs because, like I said, I'm upgrading this one. While I'm doing this one, I'm sim simultaneously doing <clears throat> this one. So I always get two. So this is the part number. It's just an extension cable, right? Extension with 18 AWG silicone wire, 12 inch. So it's a foot. Apparently, it's a foot. I don't know if it's really a foot because it starts from here and it goes all the way to Z receiver into into down there. So, I mean, it's coiled up a little bit in there, but I don't think it's an actual foot that they're giving you. So, anyway, make sure you get the, um, the extension wire. You know, I paid, you know, it's 10 bucks, 10 bucks for a little extension wire. Can you imagine? So the extension wire will actually look something, something like this. It'll have that little connection here and it'll just go into your, um, you know, receiver. Any open slot that's in there, just pop it in there and that's it. Anything that's open, you should have one, one, one or two open. Um, and make sure that the black cable is all is always facing your motor. 
always black to the right and then red out. All right. And um, yeah, so let me give you a little demonstration on this fan here. Here we go. They're pretty loud. They're very loud. Um, at the beginning, actually, when when I turn this particular X01 on, um, this fan here, it's got a little bit of a vibration going the first couple of seconds. Um, it started doing this a little while ago. I don't know if it's, maybe it's a bearing inside that's damaged already, but for first couple of seconds, it vibrates a bit and then it goes away, so. But these guys here, they're just crazy, 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 crazy phenomenal. And they blow like it's cold you know i'm touching it on the side and it is cold right so nice and cold and to keep the temperatures down and it looks awesome it looks awesome so anyway here are you know again i got these in pairs Make sure you get the part number. You know, it's worth it. It's worth getting, trust me. And um, I also got the same thing for this guy here. All right, so that's the update for now, guys. Um, nothing, nothing else has been added to these guys. You know, we've talked about the A-arms last time. And they've been awesome. They've been treating me pretty good. You know, I haven't had any kind of issues with them at all. And, uh, but this is just, <laughs> <coughs> excuse me, this is just insane. The amount of power that's coming out of here, it's just crazy. The amount of wind, I mean, and or force, whatever the word you want to use, it's pretty, pretty intense. Um, you know, I haven't tried it out yet. I haven't actually taken the car out and uh, driven it with this setup, but uh, you know, we'll do soon enough. And um, yeah, <laughs> so that's it. That's the update for now. And uh, let me turn the sucker off. And you guys have a wonderful evening. You know, it's my Sunday night here. You know, I'm always doing these videos on a Sunday night. I don't know why. It's really, really strange. I mean, you know, maybe, you know, my, my girlfriend, maybe that's why my girlfriend left. She only left like a couple hours ago, right? So um, <laughs> this is when I can actually truly kind of just relax and enjoy my hobby. Um, but not that I that I can't enjoy it while she's, you know, here. But, you know, when she's gone, it's just, I can make videos and et cetera, et cetera. <laughs> Life's good. Um, but yeah, this is it, guys. This is Z update. Really, really happy with the fans. Uh, you know, the install took, took actually about 10 minutes for, you know, for each, for each car to do. So, I'm super, super, super happy with, with the outcome here. And uh, so, yeah, if you guys have any comments, please leave a comment. Uh, if you like or dislike the video, anything helps. Or you can also subscribe as well. Um, you know, yeah, go team. Uh, so yeah, I just wanted to share what I have right now with you guys and uh, anything, you know, my next project, the next thing that, that I really, really want to do is I wanted to, you know, these bodies here, um, they are super, 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 you know, like, look at that. So a buddy of mine, he actually does, does this carbon fiber, carbon fiber stuff. So what we're going to do is we're actually going to uh he's going to create a mold 
somehow and we're going to make this body rigid rigid right so uh, the thing I want to do the, the reason why I want to do this is I know it's going to add weight but you know with this Mamba monster system I'm not worried about any kind of weight at all you know if I throw an extra two pounds on this thing I, I th it's not gonna matter because it's just it, first of all it's got a 60 mile an hour setup in here and uh, it's got so much power it's insane you know you could probably pull a Cadillac with this freaking uh, Mamba mon monster thing monster dinosaur thing uh, but it's it's a very powerful motor, you know, so I'm not worried about the weight um, You know, I'm pretty sure it's going to add a little bit, but I wouldn't mind having uh, I want to try that out I want to have a body that's completely, you know rigid. That's not like flexible and you know uh, Actually Intigy also excuse me also what they sell is um, They sell these wings you see how you see how clumsy you see how flexible this is this is like pure plastic right but Intigy sells actual carbon fiber wings or actual you know uh, metal and this is just funny I mean you know for a car that's going a hundred that's supposed to be going a hundred miles an hour you have a body like this I understand the reason why they why they make them is you know in case you hit something um so that you know the body doesn't rip into pieces etc etc so that there is some flex i understand all that but it's just a little i don't know too clumsy for me so i want to go that route maybe you know uh, if I end up doing something like that, I'll let you guys know. But uh, for sure, I want to get this wing. I want to get an NTG wing. You know, uh, this wing from Trax's body is just a piece of plastic. It's uh, and it does not. It has no effect on the car at all. And uh, so that's it, guys, for now. All right, Roger, take it easy. And until next time, for now, this is the NTG update. Voila. Take care. Ciao, ciao.